I'm us. So hot stars and all dust. And I got a colorful aura, like I got neon guts. What's up, guys? It's King Josh back with another video. And today I'm going to show you guys the best jump shot in the game. So if you ever want to test a jump shot. Oh, my PS4 is frozen. Okay, so what I was saying before is if you ever want to test out a jump shot, just come to this part of the park. It's in the alley right in between Swags and the 2K zone. So Swags is right here, the 2K zone's right there, and it's just in the alley right here. This is basically just a time to shoot around, and it's on online park difficulty. So you can just test any jump shot. Whatever you green here, you'll green in the park. So right here, I'm going to show you guys how good this jump shot is. Watch all these greens. First shot, green. Look at that, that's green. Another green, this jump shot is so good. Another green, it's so easy to time. That one was a little late there, but look, green. There's another green. That's a green. Pass, another green. Full bar. Full bar again. See how easy this is to time? Right here, green. See if we can get one more. No, we can't get one more shot. But this shot is very easy to time. It's kind of like G-Size's jump shot, and it's kind of like LaMarcus Aldridge, but it's a tiny bit slower, because those shots are a little too fast for me personally. So if you don't like super fast shots, but you want your shot to be somewhat fast, then you should use this jump shot. So I'm gonna show you guys what it is right now. Okay, so let's go to equip animations, gameplay moves, and shots. So this shot is just base 49. It's actually not a custom jump shot. I just made it one so I wouldn't have to pay for the actual jump shot, pay for the actual jump shot, pay for the actual jump shot. I'm a complete idiot. I just said that I made a custom jump shot so I wouldn't have to use this and pay for it. But you start off with all the releases, besides the NBA players. But yeah, this shot is just jump shot 49. It's so good and so easy to time. Like, you can see it looks a little awkward because he shoots so high over his head. But once his hands just get to the top of the jump shot, you just let go of square. I'll even go back to the shoot around and shoot without a meter and show you how easy it is to time just by looking at his hands. Okay, here we go, without a shot meter. All you have to do is just look at his hands. Slightly late. That's a good release. Probably should have been green. Another good release. There, that's green. Excellent release. Good release. Excellent. See how easy this is to time? Like right when his hands get to the top of the jump shot, you can tell. I'm um, letting go a little early now. Slightly early. And last shot is good. Let's go. 33 points without a shot meter. Like, I'm not really that used to shooting without a shot meter, so it's a little iffy. And also, for the shots that I missed, if you're a pure sharp with all Hall of Fame badges, you'll probably make those because I don't have badges at all. All I have are these four badges right here. I don't have any of these at all. I need to get some more badges on my sharp. So if you actually have badges, even if you're not on a pure sharp, if you have like gold shooting badges on a playmaker sharpshooter or whatever, you can probably hit shots like I can, even though I have a 96 three pointer. So that's going to be the video. If you guys enjoyed, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe if you're new to the channel and I'm out. Peace. It's catching up to me. I think it's catching up to me. Nobody's catching up to me. Nobody's catching up. Like, can I get some company?